So today we're going to install an adjustable riser on the Renegade XP. Pretty simple process. There may be some questions along the way where you just want to see how it's done. The reason I'm putting it on is that uh, when I'm standing up, which I like to ride standing up a lot, I just feel my arms aren't long enough. So I want to bring the handlebars up even just an inch. This one here goes from four inches to eight inches. So it should be plenty if I'm doing some major backcountry style riding or just even standing up on some rough trail. It should be uh, a lot more comfortable on my, uh, on my shoulders. This top cap just pops right off like so. And then you need a 10 millimeter wrench or a socket to remove the existing riser. Okay, this one as well. Lots of length there as you can see, so going to eight inches is not gonna be a problem. That's what she said. I'm gonna pull back like that on the thing, and then that cable is released. There's a little seat, there's a little circlip on, on here. Careful, it's gonna fly across the room. And you'll have a half an hour of me looking for it. There we go, clips out. There the cable can slide through. Like that. Okay, that takes care of the throttle cable. try and make these evenly bolted so that this is perpendicular to the top riser part so it's not on an angle force twisting or anything like that. Actually, have a torque spec of 15 to 21 foot pounds. Fortunately, my uh, torque wrench 
minimal is 20, so I'll end up torquing that 20 foot pound when we're all said and done. Plug that in. Plug that in. Oh, that's beautiful. Raise that up fully, and in that way, all the cables are at their maximum. That's it right there. Wow, that's high. That's gonna be awesome. One thing to note is you wanna make sure the brake reservoir is level when you put the handlebars on. I'll check that when we get to the final torquing of this device. That looks good. Let's hook the throttle cable can come in front of this like that. And I hook that back up. Got a little snap in there, so you just gotta make sure you push it into the snap inside the from behind. You'll feel it click. Never gonna have that have it that high anyway. Brake line's perfect. Okay, throttle cable from behind to the front. Looks a lot cleaner when you're sitting on the sled. down. Like that. Now that still goes up and down nice. And it looks good from the rider's viewpoint. I like it. I like it a lot. 